about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know This is what I tend to do a lot of guys Shoveling horse poo Hey Millie Hey Mills Look, say hello Say hello Mad horse Hello, yeah. Hey. <laughs> Good girl. Yeah, Yeah. Here we are again in the mad, mad world. Just doing a bit of shopping. It's draining all this. I don't know what's going on here. That's all the desserts. So there's gonna be some fatties coming out of <laughs> coming out of lockdown. Alright guys, so it's now Thursday. We're taking all these film props and stuff up to the uh, storage. We're at the horse feed place. It's just getting some feed for the horses. Not impressed, are you? Hey? What a beautiful setting for stables. Look at it. So guys, that was just a little look at um, Fair Oaks Airport near me. Quite a nice little airport, but not a lot going on there to be honest. One plane just took off, I just missed it. I think they're few and far between. But uh, yeah, we'll come up here and have breakfast one day and uh, do a bit of footage. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. Stop doing that. Who's that? Is that you? Is that you and me? Is that you and me? Is it? I'm a good girl. I'm a good girl. Yes. Morning everyone. It's now Friday morning. I hope you're all good. Just popped out to get a few bits for the parcels and that. Um, just in Little Hampton Town. Uh, I've got to uh, go back, pack some parcels. And then uh, I've got to do a couple of pickups in a minute, grab a couple of bits from the unit, and uh, then crack on. And then later on, I've got to go and do the food shopping. So I literally got home last night. So yeah, it never stops. But it's Friday morning. I hope you're all having a good day and a good start to your weekend. And uh, I'll speak to you in a bit. All right, everyone. So we're back at the car. 
I'm just going to go and do the first pickup, which I think is of the three VHSs. So I'm going to go and do that now, and then go and pick up the other pickup, which is a set of. Excuse me, I've just had some manky, horrible Domino's pizza. It was disgusting. I'm absolutely starving. Don't be eating properly, really, and that's so. I better get something to eat and a coffee. Um, yeah, so the other one is um, some Sony DR9 headphones. Um, they're up for a tenner. Said they've only been used a few times. They're vintage. Um, and I'm paying up a bit for them because they go for... I mean, some have gone for 20 without the box. Mostly without with the box, you're talking sort of... I don't know... 35, 45, 50 quids. So I'm going to get them picked up and get them straight on. Hair's a bit wild, eyes are a bit red. Got out of the shower this morning and the water just killed my eyes. Um, so, yeah, a couple of pickups. Uh, go to storage, get stuff from storage that's got to be sent off. A couple of bits I've sold. I'll show you all that when I get back to the house. Speak to you in a bit. Alright guys, so these are the first pickup. So we've got the Great War VHS's massive boxes. Loads of battle ones, taxi driver, Roy Chubby Browns, not my cup of tea, Roy Chubby Brown, Cheech and Chongs. So some good ones here, look, good father, good fellas, last of my Eacons. The Eagle's Nest. Casino sleepers. Some good ones there. So, I reckon some of them will go alright. But And the lady's just said to me that um, she's got a lot, they've probably got a load more in the loft, so she's going to give me a shout. Alright, guys, so second pickup done. Uh, I'm just going to show you now. Uh, I haven't opened the box yet. The box looks in quite good nick for its age. Um, yeah, could have a brick in there, but we're both going to find out together. Here we go. Let's have a look. Oh, they look decent. No, all the pads look good on them. As long as they work, it looks like we've got a decent set of vintage headphones here. Yeah? Alright guys, so we're at the uh, unit. I've got all my VHSs. I'm going to scan through them at the minute. I haven't got a lot of power in the thing. As you can see, we're still in this situation because I haven't been here. Um, I've just got an email through. It says it's from Royal Mail. Um, it says... They attempted to, to deliver my package at 11.15 on Friday and I need to reschedule delivery. Um, so I thought, oh, what's that all about? So I clicked on it and a thing came up on my phone and said, uh, deceptive site um, or something. So I've just deleted it off. I didn't open it, go into it. Apart from just clicking to see what it was about and say my phone lucky enough saved me and said it was deceptive site. So if you get any emails from Royal Mail saying they've attempted to deliver your parcel, I mean, you'd never get an email from Royal Mail anyway. I don't know what, what I was even thinking. Um, but anyway, all was okay. But look out for these uh, scam emails. They're all going about now. It's Christmas, everyone's trying to scam everyone, unfortunately, apart from us. Um, yeah, there's a lot of ruthless, horrible people out there. So just stay safe, be careful. And yeah, I'm going to crack on and scan some of these VHS and see whether they're worth any money. Find the bits that I've got to send off, which... Well, one of them's there. So that's one of them. And I think the other one... If I remember it wrong. Can't bloody move. The other one is... Just there. And it's the Bluetooth beanie. Bluetooth musical beanie, I think. So 
So that's that. So that's a couple of bits I've got to take home. I've got everything else at home that I've already got to send off. Over the next few days, I need to start getting all this on and listed because I'm back up to my brother's on Monday. So I need to whack as much of this on as I can. I've got some Christmas bits. Don't suppose it'll go for loads, but it'll go. I've got games and puzzles and so you've seen it before, bags and bags of stuff. Puzzles and games and all that. DVDs, CDs, roller blades. Don't need them anymore for a minute. Go through some of these CDs. I've got another box of mugs in the car, which I'm going to start listing when I get home. Once I've done my parcels and everything else, obviously. Um, yeah. So I'm going to crack on with that and. Uh, yeah, I shall uh, see you back at the house. Hey everybody, right, I'm back at home. So I've got, I've got a wax scribe from Gladiator to send off. I've got a box of Casino Royale money, got to go off. I've got the prop coal from the Titanic. I've got the Wi-Fi beanie. I've got the sealed fact or fiction game. I've also got that from Badlands. It's not going to hurt anybody. It's made of rubber. Uh, and I've got to find a CD. Um, so I've got all those to go off. All right, everyone. So you're not going to believe this. I've just been down to my, to, down to my shed to have a little sort out and grab a couple of bits and boxes and that. And I was moving some stuff and I've got to find a CD and I thought, oh, it's going to be right over the back. I thought I'll look for that tomorrow anyway. So I started moving some stuff off my seat and some CDs and DVDs and stuff. So I was moving and moving. And I thought, I'll just check through these to see whether the CD's there. This has got to be the easiest thing I've ever found. Thai classical music. The sound of Saw Sam Sai. It's gone for a tenner. So, yeah, so that was easy. Right, so I'm not tight. But, I do like to recycle stuff, so I've ripped a... Oh, one of my dogs wants me that. Hello. She hasn't seen me for a week, so she's all happy, aren't you, eh? Hey? Good girl. Um, yeah, so, taking a, an old uh, envelope apart that's come to us, with a model in for my son. I'm going to use that to wrap around the... Um, CD that's, that's sold and then put it into another bubble wrap envelope just to double it up. I think they're hungry. You hungry? Are you hungry? Oh my god, oh my god, the pair of you. I better get their food. Right, everyone, it's now Saturday morning and uh, I've just edited most of this video. I'm just adding this bit onto the end. So obviously just to finish it up, um, it's absolutely grotty out there today. As you can see, it is disgusting weather, disgusting behaviour. But anyway, just wanted to say, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a smash that thumbs up, give it a big thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. Uh, we've had a lot of new subscribers just lately, so thank you very much. I really appreciate every single one of you. As I always say, you know, it means the world to me. Um, just knowing that people like my content and want to watch it. And as I've said in uh, lives and stuff, you know, it's a weird time. We're all locked down. If you want to contact me, you can contact me through Instagram, which is Richie Rich Star. Um, contact me through there if you want just to chat or you want my advice or something um, I may be able to help you out um, you can join the Facebook page if you're not already which is resellers are us which is like toys are us just the letter R resellers are us come and join that you know you can share your sales your pickups um, your, your, your fails you know all your decent stuff whatever um, or just say hello or asking advice or whatever um, yeah so if you uh, 
I've lost, forgotten where I was now. But if you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. And if you are subscribed, make sure you hit that notification bell to see to be alerted of whenever I'm uploading a new video or going live. We got there in the end. I'll see you later. Night's life. Subscribe to it. He's a lovely lad. They're a lovely family. It's a lovely life and he's a lovely man. Subscribe to him.